guys, John here. Welcome back to another video. I missed quite a few teasers on Toyota Japan's website. Let's talk about them in this video. All right, so what we're looking at is Toyota Japan's website. Everything is in Japanese, and there was one photo from this that was on their Instagram yesterday, but I completely failed to see that there were a ton more photos. So we have the countdown right here. We have the link to the live stream if you guys want to tune in for that on the 1st of August. But we have all these photos down here, right? So if we zoom in, we can see the photos a little better. Unfortunately, we couldn't click on them to bring up a high res. This is all they give us. But we see the full picture of the lights on the back, the rear tail lights. Again, a lot of people are hoping that this is a split tailgate. It's going to be hard to tell in these photos. They may have mimicked the look of it. Not 100% sure yet. We will see on August 1st. But you'll notice as we scroll through each photo, the Land Cruiser itself is like grayscale, and then there's a color to each photo. So this one, you know, the fire pit on the beach is in color. This is the one that we saw on the Instagram the other day. The dirt on this one is in color. We're going down further. You got like some flowers right here, but this is a good photo of the front of it. So we're able to see the lights up here. It looks like triple beam LED headlights. This little, uh, spot down at the bottom that I thought may have potentially been a vent. It's actually going to be our fog lights. And then it looks like here on the left hand side, we have some vents too. And then up under the, the headlight, we have a vent there as well. Nice big fenders. We can see some off-road tires right here. Scrolling down some more, we have this ABCD pillar in the back that really looks like the GX550. We have the shark fin antenna, kind of looks like FJ Cruiser-esque too in the back, which I really like that. And again, we have a leaf that is a color right here. Going down further, we have the other side. So this is going to be the passenger side of the new Land Cruiser. And we have the same type of mirror right here that the GX550 has. I really like the placement of it. It's a very cool nod to older Land Cruiser uh, mirrors and also the FJ Cruiser but we can see the top of the wheel arch. We can see the bulge of the hood there too, the rake of the front windshield. And then you can also see on the A pillar, this kind of like black line that follows all the way to the back. It's pretty nice. And then going down here, we have like a dragonfly that's in color. And then another look at the triple beam lights, the little grill or intake, maybe potentially that is up under those lights, to hopefully feed a V6 engine twin turbo, we shall see. But then this also is a good money shot right here. So looking at this, right, we can see the knob right here for the different modes of the transfer case. Looks like we're gonna have a full-time four-wheel drive vehicle with three options for that four-wheel drive there too, lows and highs. And then we have a rear locking diff. Right up above it, we do not have a center locking diff, at least in this photo, we shall see with other ones because the GX550, the Overtrail, it had a center locking diff and a rear locking diff. Maybe other models of this Land Cruiser will have both. We have the traction control off, the whole button, the parking brake, and our gear selector right there. Very different center console compared to the GX, which you guys can see right here. Completely different center console, and that's it. And with this photo right there, the thing that is in color is a feather. So not sure what all these colors mean. Uh, maybe it's colors of the vehicle like they did with the Tacoma. That was my wife's suggestion, but we shall see uh, all the colors, hopefully, in the press release when that comes out. So what do you guys think about those additional photos? Are you stoked for this Land Cruiser? Let me know down in the comment section. Again, a reminder, if you guys are new to this channel, I will be showcasing this brand new Land Cruiser on August 1st here on the channel, live in person, like actually hands on this vehicle. It's gonna be so nice. And also too, if there is a good enough cell connection, we will have live stream here on YouTube and mostly a live stream over on my Instagram. But guys, I appreciate you watching and I'll catch you all in the next one. All right, see you later.